All right. Twan and Kecker. But yeah, interesting matchup. I haven't really seen like Kecker versus Twan. Ooh, Twan, LeCount, Alucard, Facing Cacker again. Twan is very professional. Got some open but yeah, do you here. ever see Twan just go up there and say what up to him? Ever see Twan out and say what up to him? Real cool dude. Hey, Twan the resident favorite here. Ooh, big body matchup. T Hawk Timothy Hawkins versus Hugo. T Hawk versus Hugo. Did I miss much? They're gonna change the sage. I take it not much. But so we got we got the big bodies here. Big Hawk versus Hugo. They're gonna change the stage. All right, we got so we got big body against big body here. I just got linked up with the new uh, Dragon Ball Z movie. <laughs> My uh, pocket is godlike right now. Ooh, Hugo. So, we got Mick Dougie oh, coming oh to commentate. What's the score? Uh, there is first, uh, first, game. first game. Oh my Steve. god, the claps. The claps. The clap, the clap oh pressure. You can sit if you feel like it. Kaker gets the SPD. He's probably Ooh. going to stay same side. Oh no. He, 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 or stay same side. Whatever. Ooh. The clap and the low. He tries to whip punish the clap with the ES counter. Ooh, Ooh nice. Didn't work out. Antoine gets the nice combo. Cross, yeah. Ooh, he tried to go for a tricky uh, empty jump low. Stays in front. Good block. He gets another another SPD. Can do this. Round buffering so he can react. Most of them big Oh, body. good roundhouse. Big baby. That's this an SVD punch. Yeah. Nice. Street is the, thing, is the most racist game I've ever seen. It is. It was, you know, Letting a white the, man be Indian. All the, all the stereotypes, they exist in this game, man. Letting all the black the white characters man suck. Be Indian. Um, well, I'd say K KOF is a little more racist with that background. Oh, now yeah. They got yeah, KOF 13. They be going ham in the background. Hell yeah. <laughs> that background is. Ooh. Something. That's all I can say. Around, it's something. Kaker doesn't really have to do too much to have the life lead. Yeah. Blocking all the pressure. Don't overextend. Can you get the extension? Conversion. Ooh. Stay with him back up. With clap pressure, that's plus. Wow. Kaker is a punisher. He got the punish on the uh, with clap. Go, Tina. It doesn't work out. 
Oh, oh my god. Nice clap. Well, I didn't confirm, but the pressure is still on. Good stand right. Oh my god. Stand. Ooh. All Kaker doesn't have to, all Kaker has to do is get one more hit. And it should probably be like oh there we go. Stand the Mark jab. stand strong for the win. Kaker gets round one. Man, you can see it, you can see Twan like good jab. <laughs> his heart is just leaping from his chest. That's just pressure around. Good combo by Twan. Oh, he wakes up with the EXSBD. Takes a nice chunk of damage. What's the setup? Oh, he tried to do a stand round house. Tried to do something guy like this. Oh, he, oh, he gets the beast flasher. Um, I don't think so. He might be able to get a DP with its added juggle potential because that does launch. Oh, so I don't know. Okay. And he gets the meat squash there. And Antoine turns it right around. He says, this is my moment, so I'm going to keep this shit. You say, this is my game. He's like, this is my game, man. He's like, He's you know who I beat? The German. He Ooh. said, so you know who I beat? He said, I beat Momochi. Momochi. He beat Gamer B. He beat Gamer B. Ooh, good SPD by Kaker. He has a healthy life lead. All he has to do is not get touched by Antoine. Twan is a monster on offense. Wow, Ooh, nice Ooh. Nice. Ooh, Ooh, good combo nice by Kaker. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nice. Oh, that was a nice reaction. Please do not test those because Twan will Come kill at you. Oh, did you. I mean, do you see Do you see when he when he won that match against Momichi, he was able to like, grab his can out of the air with that move? Ooh. Good combo. Gonna go for a meaty clap setup. Ooh. Nice back Backs off. What's he gonna do? Oh. Oh, he tries oh. to punish the uh, counter fire, but it doesn't work out. Oh, that's God. A dead, oh my God. That's a get dead T. Oh, GG's. Nice effort by Kaker. He almost had it. Almost. He almost had it. I think he uh, got a little bit too nervous Twan trying to go for a, a super hard read. Twan but he, did, he really didn't. He really needed to just sit back and just kind of poke at Hugo and keep him from doing what he wanted. Don't um, backdash on the Ultra 2 or jump. Don't jump. Don't do anything airborne. Twine will react to it. Um, funny thing about Hugo, a lot of people like to jump back against all of his setups. Like, say, for example, I do two claps uh, and I do a low jab. A lot of people are like, oh, he's going to grab me, right? Or he's going to go for a meat squasher. Um, it, Twan, what he likes to do is he likes to condition you to, that he's going to grab you and he will try to get you to jump back, allowing him to get a get a, um, a EX backbreaker or a Ultra 2. Now, the way to beat it is to jump forward, actually, because the setups aren't actually designed to catch them forward. Uh, but nope, not many people know that. So.